Have you had to break into the piggy bank to cover living expenses during COVID life? I got to tell you, you're not alone. A study by Northwestern Mutual, and we're going to see this pop up very shortly, says that there are 38% of Americans have dipped into some kind of savings. For instance, 19% have dipped into personal savings or emergency funds. 13% have borrowed money from family or from friends. And then last but not least, there are about 9% that have dipped into retirement savings like a 401k or in IRA. Okay, so how do you get back on track? You want to treat your savings like a bill. So um, you hear the saying all the time, pay yourself first. If, if all you can do is $5, then do $5. But you have to start from somewhere. So Terrence Floyd of Northwestern Mutual says the key to actually saving that five bucks or 50 bucks or let's say even 150 bucks every single paycheck is to automate the savings. Set up your direct deposit each month to have a certain amount go to your savings account. Don't even give yourself the option of not moving it out of your checking account to your savings. And the next piece of free advice of uh, finances, make a budget. Really, I know it's old school, but it works. But you want, you want to um, have a budget because you want to be able to tell your money uh, where to go versus asking questions as far as where where has your money been and that's a great point your budget gives you freedom and it's going to be difficult at first you're not going to get it right the first month the second month and not even the third month but it just takes practice all right when you think of your budget you think of bills like let's say your rent or your car payment or maybe your utilities okay but that's not all of it there's more than that one of the budget pitfalls is forgetting those non-monthly costs like yearly insurance premiums or your auto registration fees oil changes even the vet bills for your pet and then there's this you ready yeah, the countdown to Christmas, you know. Okay, you will buy some presents. You will buy some decorations. Put that in the budget too. Again, so you have the freedom of spending how you want versus paying for something that is totally unplanned. Northwestern Mutual has a six step process for coming up with that kind of budget. And guess what? We've linked you, of course, to the article in the two wants to know section to make it easy for you to save.